Do you know what solar panels do? They harvest the energy from the sun. Why does my candle keep burning out? Because the battery dies. You gotta charge oh, it. Oh, so I charge it in, and the sun goes through the wine into the candle. We are raising voyagers. We have spent the last few years going on adventures around the world, but like most people, had to change our plans once 2020 kept us on the ground. We found a van! We decided to convert the Sprinter van into a tiny house on wheels and take travel into our own hands. We have been building our tiny house from the ground up, installing our own windows, plumbing, recirculating shower system, air conditioning unit, and electrical. In today's video, we install our solar panels. So we have to cut these aluminum L channels or angle channel or aluminum angle. Don't know what you really call them. To go across the, I guess I don't know what anything's called. What is that called? Uh, to go across the roof. And then that will, will be what we actually screw on the solar panels to. All right, just four more to go. Noisy. It wasn't? It wasn't? Okay. So this is the solar panels? Yeah. So the sun goes into the solar panels and then the panel converts it to electricity and then that electricity goes through the wires and then charges up your Kindle. Well, I know that what electricity goes through wires. I know that. All right. So next up, we're going to take these guys up on the roof to measure out the holes that I'll have to drill in and then we'll come down and drill them. And this means no. Now, then you gotta face the tool, put your safety goggles on. So we always do safety first, okay? Here's the safety lessons. You don't ever touch that. And what you're gonna do is just move this down, okay? I'm gonna get it all set up for you. How about that? Is that better? Okay, so you ready? Go very slowly. science experiment? Uh-huh. The solar panels rectangles are higher than 100. So, in electricity, there is positive and negative wires. I know. You know all about electricity. Yep. So this little guy will read and tell you how many volts. Volts is how much electricity there is. How many volts do you think this is? I wonder. All right. 100. 16. So, if you want to hold that one there, and I'll hold this one here. 18.6 volts. Did I say 18? From what? From the sun. So it's capturing the sun's energy oh, and converting I did it into 18. electricity. If we plugged a fan into this or a light, it would work. They didn't wow. know. Crazy, huh? I guessed it. I said 18. No, you said 16. I don't want to save you. Don't want to be strangers. Let me feel like you know what to do. Leave your limitations, live and go against them Just let go and start up something new Cause I know, I know, I know the what you planned out Everything that you built up It's not exactly going as planned Oh, that's easier New plan is to use self-tapping screws I'm glad to go in the world does the song from Frozen? I wanna sing for you. Some things never 
Is that it? Well, I think it keeps going. Oh, oh I do Just the warm now. Okay. Well, you want to see what we're doing? All right now, we are using some washers to bring the level up in order to space this across and have it be level. Is that interesting? And then there's boring? a hot pot in the song. Do you want to help me work? Okay, yeah. in just one minute, you're going to help attach these. One, two, three, four, five. Once I call it a fish a lot. Well, today is day two of the install, only because I only got about an hour of productivity in yesterday, because I got a call that involves completely uprooting our family and our lifestyle and changes everything, and it just kind of made my head go So, thanks Patrick. Getting back to the install today, trying to focus, and gonna knock this thing out. So I set up a little sunshade and a fan because at nine o'clock in the morning, it is completely unbearable up here. So, work smarter, not harder. I'm feeling trapped down on the floor. I don't know what for. Feels like I'm gonna lose. Silence takes a hold. I can't let it go. Can't up, no one knows. But I won't let the stormy seas fill me in open water. Let me have my peace and leave me to tomorrow. Wind into my face. So I'm sort of playing this by ear, but I think my approach is going to be to get the panels fixed to the L bracket and then um, I'll take everything off, clean the roof because I'm making a lot of metal shavings and then patch the wires and bolt it back on again. So I'd like to say this was planned, but there's always an element of luck. Look how tightly that fits. Barely get it past the fan. And looking great. You know, it's really bad out when I'm forced to wear a hat. I can hardly breathe out here, it's so nasty. But that uh, fan and the sunshade is helping things along. All right, next. I am going to wire these panels up in series. Um, there's like a dozen different ways you can do this, but I'm gonna be lazy and just wire it up in series. And then I need to poke a hole somewhere around here. I'll probably punch it from underneath the van and then widen it and then patch those cables through. Well, somehow we lost that footage, but in our next video, we work on installing our cabinets and our sink and fridge.